In terms of Liz Truss, I mean, obviously she's only been in a couple of weeks. It's been an outstanding beginning, hasn't it? <laughs> <laughs> she's tanked the pound lower than my reputation in Liverpool. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, I mean, what, what worries me is, I know there were the tax cuts last week. There was no, there was no high net worth wealthy person on over £150,000 a year expecting, wanting a tax break last week, but they got it. And yet they did it. But that didn't really tell me the most about them. What worried me, not what worried me the most, but what told me the most about them was that last week, Kwasi Kwarteng, in his new house, went and knocked on Liz's door and said, what I think we should do this week in the midst of a cost of living crisis, energy crisis, people worried about paying their bills, people worried about food, I think we should remove the cap on bankers' bonuses. <laughs> How can you possibly, in a million years, think that way? I think they're the only man and woman in this country that thought that would be a good idea last week. <laughs> so, from that point of view, I have to say that the time has come for them to leave office. It really has. The general election can't come sooner. <laughs> and We, we can sit in here from whatever background you come from. We were brought up by our parents and our grandparents to know what right and wrong was, to know that you look after people, you treat people well, and they don't do that. They don't do that. <laughs>